Hello everyone, Mr. Jake here with Pete the Cat, and we are at the Lidice Memorial in Sokol Park in Phillips. Uh, originally when our county first started out, uh, there was a settlement of Polish and Czechoslovakian people. And that settlement was called Sailor Creek, and that area was between Fifefield and Phillips. Um, with such a high population and percentage of Czechoslovakian people, uh, there was a lot of Czechoslovakian culture and tradition that also settled in the Phillips area. Uh, now, the Sokol movement was actually a patriotic movement that happened in Czechoslovakia. Uh, it was a movement of being well-rounded and being a good citizen. And uh, the word Sokol actually stands for uh, representing a, a falcon or a daring bird that is in flight. But the motto was to be a good citizen, to be fine in mind and body, and to be strong and healthy. Now, the Phillips Sokol Group was an organization that started meeting in the 1920s, so just about 100 years ago. And the land that this park and the memorial here uh, behind me is located on was purchased in 1927. Uh, the Phillips area Sokol group did have uh, a hall that they would have dances, they would have uh, plays, they would have parties, and uh, it was a very important part of the community. Well, unfortunately, sometimes human history has a dark chapter, and one of the darkest was World War II. Now, in the 1940s, while World War II was occurring, uh, German armies invaded uh, Czechoslovakia and there was some pushback from the people and unfortunately due to that pushback uh, the German armies decided that they would make an example out of the town of Lidice and they completely destroyed the town and unfortunately a lot of people were hurt and worse um, so following that horrible atrocity that happened the people in Phillips with their strong ties to the Czechoslovakian community and to the nation of Czechoslovakia. They decided they would erect this memorial, this monument. And uh, they built it in 1944, which was two years after the town of Lidice was completely wiped out. Um, and uh, they also buried a time capsule here. Now, at one point, the time capsule was supposed to be opened far off in the future of the year 2015. But unfortunately, some vandals stole the time capsule. But uh, the police department in Phillips did recover it, and it has been on display at the Phillips Public Library for many years. So next time you're able to be in the library and pay us a visit, stop by and check it out. It's a neat little piece of local history. Um, so 40 years after this memorial was made to the town of Lidice, uh they were going to do some light repairs to it and rededicate it for the 40th anniversary of it. And this was in 1984. Well, they decided that maybe they should do more than just have a ceremony to rededicate it. And a bunch of people in the community that were very active decided to have a Czechoslovakian festival. Well, every year at the end of the Phillips Czech Fest, uh, there's a memorial service that takes place here to remember all of those people that unfortunately suffered uh, due to war and due to unnecessary hatred. So just remember everyone, uh, we can always learn lessons from the past, we can take pride in our community, we can honor those before us, and uh, we can never be too kind to one another. So from the Phillips Public Library, Mr. Jake and Pete the Cat here, signing off.